Hi all, it's Travels and More with Jason. Well, again, it's a pickup video. I'm taking a leaf out of Renal Refuse and buying a job lot. But it's not the same as what Luke does. This is where I bought a job lot for one vehicle. It, and everything else in this job lot, I've already got. But the price I paid makes it very good. Now they're all parts, not one of them are complete. So, but the one vehicle I wanted that I've not got, the buy complete, looking at anything from 100 to 200 pounds. So what I paid in total, including posts and packaging, was £35. And it's about 10 vehicles, if I remember rightly. So it goes down to not a lot of money. And then basically, all the rest I will book for sale. So I'll basically recover the £35 I have spent. So uh, come and join me and see what I've inquired, acquired. Right, and before we do, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, please share, please subscribe, and I'll see you, see us, you know. <laughs> Let's have a look at what we got. Now, this is the same order, but obviously the guy couldn't send it in one box. He obviously didn't have a big enough box, but I did pay £10 in postage, so I don't mind. Uh, so there we are. My cat is trying to attack me again. Uh, so uh, let's get out. So what we do, we start with a small one, see what's in there. Uh, I'm not happy it's slightly damaged here. So I'm hoping he's packaged it and, and make sure the bubble wrap in there. That one just as much, you know, it's a bit flatted. So yeah, let's get this one open, shall we? See what I've inquired. Well, I've opened it up. Straight away, I'm happy to see bubble wrap. So if this guy knows how to send stuff, so that's good. So, and lovely little bubble wrap that I can wrap up myself stuff. Right. So, you know, if these are like parts, really. Right, that's that one. Right, next one. Funny thing is, I had parts of this and I sold them. I could have had near enough complete one. Oh no, it's bottom there. That's well, not too bad. I know what it's missing. The legs. And the uh, source points. And the missiles. Alright. So that. A set of wheels. So I've got no idea what vehicle they came from. Apart from they could be Cobra by that purple. All right. Now I've already got a couple of these, but again, these would be getting passed on to sell. So it's that one and that one. So that's that. Right, that's the first box emptied now. Like I said, not the best. Right, let's get the big box open now, shall we? Right. I like how you put a layer in, so again. Now I'll really see what I believe is the one I want. 
but we start this way. Now I believe I've got the wheels for this. Yeah, I've got the extra set of wheels for this. So, not too bad. Sure, that can be fixed. Um, yeah, not bad, not bad at all. Quite happy with that one. Now, there is, I'm hoping, this one I'm going to pull out. There's actually the part that I want, but I've got a feeling it hasn't. And no, straight away I can see it hasn't got the part I want. My one is still miss is missing that part. And as you see, it's not there. Alright, but there is some parts inside. Hmm. I think that belongs to the Oh, the hovercraft. Oh, I can't think what it's called at the moment. I think that's one of the engines. If it is, that's good. That's a part I will be keeping. I've got some of the missiles of that one as well. So that's good. Huh. Oh, it's missing one of the rings on this side. But yeah, it's a good part job. Uh, like I said, you know, we'll be getting past them. Right. Yep, here's one more. The said false. Like you can tell, you know, the guy's definitely used these as parts. Good old action false. That's quite nice, actually. But I've already got one, like I said to you. Alright. Now the last one is the biggest one. And it's the one that I wanted. And I've got it upside down. Tip away. Can you guess what it is? It's the APC, Armour Personnel Carrier. There we are. Look at that. That is the one I've been after. Right, let's get rid of the bubble wrap and we'll have a look at this one better. Right, here it is. It's one of the things I was after. I was hoping to get the American version when I was in America. And then get the said false one when I was back in the UK. But it didn't happen. Um, well, this came up on this job lot. I was looking. I was just looking for Action Force and G.I. Joe job lots. This, this lot came on and I saw this. And I thought, the price he wanted to buy it now. I thought, yeah, snap it up. And he even had it off one, so I actually originally cost was thirty pounds, so it would be forty quid altogether. Asked him to offer twenty, got automatic design, so it means he had the off, you know, the rejected button on. So I sent another one off for twenty five, and it got accepted. Well worth what it is. Alright, let's get the roof off and have a proper look at it and get, I think this is the bumper. Well, there's one clip broken, but I don't mind because it's just going to be on display. You see the turret's missing. So, yep. Yeah. Now, inside, obviously it hasn't got the stretcher or other parts like lid that goes on there. Or the seat belt. But these are parts I don't really mind because at some point I will get them. So, what I'm going to be looking for to get it completed and look good on display will be the front part and the calibre. 
Now, you're probably wondering what was in the bubble wrap. Well, let's find out. Right, two more vehicles. Now, these are Q Force. That one. And I do believe level one is the same. Yep. There we are. But you got to admit, that one's the nicest. Hmm. Cool. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. So, eight vehicles in total. So, I think it works out to about four pounds. Let's do some. Let's see if my maths are right. And I do think I'm wrong. Could be less. Let's go from three quid, shall we? Three pounds, six pounds, nine pounds, twelve pounds, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one. 24. Nope. No. Nope. Uh, make it four quid. Yeah, it's about four pounds something each. And like I said, all that I'm going to be uh, passing on and selling. Because I only thing I wanted was that. Right, let's go and check something out. Ten actually counting them. So, yeah, not far off of what I said. So yeah, um, yeah, I do need the wheels, axles, and other bits to complete this. Well, I will, I'm hoping, because I'm going to Necker in three days' time after this video gets released. Maybe if I'm lucky, I will find some parts there for this guy. So, fingers crossed. All right. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little uh, unboxing. I just now got to complete it. And um, if I spend 50, 60 quid on the parts, I've still got a bargain, haven't I? So, you know, basically when they're going complete, well, not complete. Uh, normally on eBay, they're from about 100 mark. They're missing the seat belt, the stretcher inside. Complete is roughly the 200 pound mark. So if I can get the turret and the front cover, the wheels and axles for less than 100, then yeah, I've got a bargain. Anyway. I'm happy. I'll see you all later. If you remember, give me, you know, give me a thumbs up and share the thing to any other action force or finchy toy collectors. Or G.I. Joe. Anyway, yo. Nah. Bye.